Paul swapped the smell of burning rubber and roar of the engine for the smell of the grease paint and the roar of the crowd. But his theory test failure was a real slap in the face for him. I thought it was a dog or a sail through me. I so I thought. I, I thought it a sail through me 11 plus and all. <laughs> a levels and O levels. I've sailed through loads of exams, mate, and that's just what I do sail through them. <laughs> Don't get anything, just sail through. It's been a stressful three weeks for Paul's instructor, Tony, and like the course of true love, Paul's course of driving lessons has been far from smooth. Uh -oh. Sorry, Tony. <laughs> Tony and family are in the audience tonight to see if Paul performs better on stage than he does in the car. It's going to be great seeing Paul at last do uh, driving a car that he can't smash up. Um, uh, uh, he can't smash it up, can he? I hope. I tell you what, I'll turn to do another year of chizzy chizzy bang bang than do a theory testing. <laughs> And if you don't mind, I'm about to go on stage, so I have to prepare myself. I have to focus. <laughs> oh! I'm focused. Paul plays the evil child catcher. If he really wants to scare the kiddies, maybe he should offer them a lift in his Ford Fiesta. Oh, children! I can smell children! Children in a toy shop? Don't be absurd. <laughs> <laughs> If only Paul's driving career had taken off so successfully. Passing his driving test is still nothing more than a flight of fancy. As the curtain falls, it's time for Paul to face another test. The critics. Were his vocal skills any improvement on his vehicle skills? I, I so much enjoyed that. And the kids loved it. Jan loved it. We all loved it. It's great. How are you? Did you like it? <laughs> yeah. Did you like it, kids? Yeah. They, thought, they thought you were coming to get them. No. Yeah. <laughs> Money mashing. Look at me with my flowers. That's oh, lovely. I got a floral tribute tonight. <laughs> what do you like, though? Hey? What happened today? Watch, oh, with the, with the theory. I know, I'm sorry about I passed the hazard. Yeah. I passed uh, that, no messing. Yeah, I, th I thought you'd do well on that. Yeah, and I've, do you, I failed you the theory. you're now in the same category as Jane? <laughs> I'm, that's the biggest downer. Of... Fancy failing me theory. Aren't I stupid, eh? Did Be you rush it? Eh? Did you, did you rush it? Tony, don't <laughs> kick off on me. I've had a terrible hard day. To the ridiculous and Paul O'Grady's next lesson. Oh, we're in a ditch. <laughs> Don't look at me when you're talking to me. No, don't do that. <laughs> what was I doing? Yeah, you're drifting to the left. It's because of the way he came round that corner. I didn't do the, um, the dinner plate thing, which I can't do. I'll have to Who's told you dinner plates? There's someone told you to use yeah. a dinner plate? Yeah, to use a dinner plate. I, I dropped it, Sean. <laughs> I was doing it last night and I dropped it. Got dinner plates bowed, smashed in the kitchen, because <laughs> I'm pretending to drive. And Murphy said, what are you doing? I said, I'm pretending it's a steering wheel. He said, why don't you go out and sit in the car and pretend? Instead of smashing all your good plates up. It's the Greek in me. <laughs> this is hideous. Oops. A little bit more. Like it. I'm, I'm not going round and round about again, so I'm going straight up. Can I? No, not this one. We're going to, we're going to Canterbury. We've got to go that one. <laughs> Paul is off for a second crack at his theory test. But when it comes to swatting up on the highway code, the signs don't look good. I've read that book cover to cover till I've gone mad. Do you know the highway code backwards? Uh, I know what it says. Very boring. That's, that's my complaint yeah. about it. Don't enter a yellow box junction unless your exit is clear, unless you're turning to the right and are prevented from leaving by oncoming traffic or other vehicles waiting to turn to the right. Oh God, Tony, you've got to start going out more. <laughs> <laughs> Bet Paul wishes he'd stayed at home today. They're heading for trouble as the forecast creeps well below zero. Thankfully, that's the temperature rather than his theory test score. Trust it's a snow. It's going to stick this is. Do you think so? It's going to be a blizzard in 20 minutes. Oh, goodness. Jade's not the only one struggling in the test car park. Oh, well, I have to teach you to reverse park. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, no, Tony. Piece of cake. You watch no. this. You watch no. how brilliant you're going to be. No way. Oh, I'll never get in that. Come on, just get on with it. 
Now I'm going to have no, some. No, Look in the mirror. What can you see? I can see a white car. But I, don't, I have no idea, Tony, how I'm going to whether I'm going to hit it or what am I doing now? Just go back a little bit. Oh, right. This thing's bleeping like a... Yeah, that's OK. Now we've got to steer two turns to the right. Go Come on! on. What, you, what are you waiting for? Five gun salute? No, <laughs> we just need to tidy it up a bit. That's it. When you start getting the beats getting really... Oh, that oh. means we're really close. Oh, close. right. Relax. <laughs> Didn't enjoy that. That's on occasion, luck. <laughs> With their cars finally parked, it's time to face the music and give the theory another go. I must have known I was coming. I'll have a look, but I'm not a virgin, you know what I mean? This is like this is my second time. <laughs> right. Mr. Paul O'Grady. See you later. Right, good luck, Paul. Take your time. Take a seat there and wait. If Paul takes his time, he'll be fine. But I don't think he read half the questions last time. Sometimes he's asked for two answers or three answers per question. And he said you just put one down for everyone. But uh, he's got all the intelligence he needs, but the common sense is lacking. <laughs> Gonna come out and tell me. <laughs> well, that's bad news, isn't it? It's hard though, isn't it? I think it's boring, you say. Sit there and we'll see. But I don't think I've done well. Bad news, isn't it? I can tell. I'm afraid so, Paul. Oh, yes. God. Yes. Oh, it's not it... fair. Look, why don't I just write you a check and leave me alone? <laughs> I don't want to learn to drive. There's taxis and buses. Get lost. Go on. I've had enough now. What did I fail on? You were one short. One. You could have given me one. If I was 50, I was one out, you miserable bastards. <laughs> one. I was one out. That's all. One. I'm going to put your... No wonder you get abuse. One out. One out. One out. Best of luck, love, in there, I tell you. No good reading that. Seriously. No good. Forget it. You might as well go home now. Have a look in your book. We'll see you again. You won't. We'd like to see no, you again. No, you won't. I've retired. I've retired. <laughs> That's it now. Comic relief and go and shove their head somewhere. <laughs> Believe you me. We've got a lesson tomorrow, Paul. No, I'm doing no more driving. So and furthermore, I'm going to start smoking again. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it. And drugs and drink, prostitutes, the lot. I'm going to do it all. I'll just put this camera on me. Watch my lips, OK? Viewers, BBC, I am not interested in driving. I am not taking this f***ing test for nothing ever again. All right? Bye-bye. See ya. Nice seeing ya. Ta-da. Ta-da.